Hey guys, this is June Killer, and I'm going to be showing you a small video on how to program your own small game. Now, I'm going to try. <coughs> sorry. I'm going to be doing this uh, in quite a few episodes. I know it's just small tutorials, with, and this is going to use Code Game Lab. Unfortunately, you can't get this on Mac, only on, um, what was it? PC. And these games can go directly to the Xbox, so you can make your own Xbox games. Even I publish them, but just play it on your Xbox. So it's quite cool. So now I'm going to show you the features. With your, there are lots of different kind of icons. Um, your, your screen might be like this. Press S to edit your screen. So there's, there's play game, move camera, and lots of other stuff. To move, If you want to move the camera, you can use your WASD keys just to move around. And to pan your screen, right click. Oopsies, that's a little too much. Just right click and just drag your screen around to pan around like that. This is just moving your um, camera around. And then, next, this is just home where you can save stuff, playing the game after you put all the commands and stuff. Now, I'm going to show you the first step. This is a br brush, so where you can create more land for whatever you want to do with it. So, you just want to create, maybe you want to create land like that. So, you just put land everywhere. I don't know. Okay, like, okay, just move your, just keep on holding the left mouse button, and just drag it around, whatever, whatever you want to do, and then you should paint. Uh, okay, sorry about that, and just quickly paint things and stuff. There we go. So now you have this, um, it, yeah, if you easy scroll, you can get closer and farther. Or see, right now we have this some kind of like um, platform, right? Let's just put this up a little more. I'm gonna be showing you some other options. So here, if you want to go into here, this is like creating valleys or hills. You might want to do you can do circle, hard. You can right click, click on the shape, do much softer edges, and this small hills, softer hills. See now you can start making hills. I'm just going to use this. See right now how I'm making hills? With a cool turn. Like that. So now you just make some mountains. Isn't that cool? If you want to make water, you can go to your brush, press this. This is types of what you like types of land. It's water. You can put some water like that over here. Coloring up some of the land. Yeah, there you go. Now I can just pan the screen, just move my camera. So I have this. Now, you want to make some characters. That's called um, ed add or edit characters. Go in further to the screen. And you want to just click. And you can start making stuff. You can make pipe trees and stuff like that. But this is, uh, and you want to get a code. Now, Kodu is like your main character. You can program to do. You can program him to do things. I'm gonna be doing a small program, so I want to click here, and I'm going to click. Actually, no. I'm gonna go here, and I'm gonna make. You can get items. So here, I'm gonna make a cannon. You wanna, and you wanna go back to Kodu, and you wanna right click him. Now, you, there's lots of things, but right now you just wanna program him. Now you have this. What you want to do, see this, it might be a little bit confusing, but I'm just going to be t telling you the basics. So th this is called an algorithm. An algorithm is when you have a when and a do, and you program to do stuff. For example, press when you do the WASD keys, I want you to move. Now, if you press um, escape and press play game, I can move around. But, but it's really slow, so you may want him to go faster. You may, may want him to go faster. Go back and do this tool, right click him, and you want to do change settings. You can do the forward speed change, turning speed, like that. Wait, I just found that. Turning accelerator, like that. And while you're going to show hit points, yes. And you can do hit points, like for example, the cannon hits you. How many times you can get hit before dying? 
see above the water, you can see above the water. The size, bounciness, friction, all these stuff. We we'll press S to to um rent, you know, make it no and program again. And then you can do things like this. When you bump into an a cannon, I want you to eat it. Then you can make these things. When you hmm, what should I say? Hmm. But anyway, see this is like this does basic things. I wanna play a game. Oh I've got the one thing right. Go back in here, program uh, in here, all you wanna do when you keyboard uh was it misc space oopsies misc space I want you to move and you go do another one quickly Quickly, quickly, so it moves really quickly now. Now I want to program the cannon to do something. I'm gonna go in here. I'm just gonna do first Control C. Oopsies, Control V, Control V. There you go. So just put the mouse where you want it, and then do Control V. So now I'm gonna program. Actually, it is a little too much. Maybe two should be enough. Now I'm gonna program them to shoot me. So what you wanna do is right click, program. Now what you wanna do. When you see what you're gonna do here, just really cool commands. You can try doing yourself. I'm gonna say C. If you see a Kodu, so that's the main character of us, I want you to shoot them. That's all you need to do. Also, as in, also as in, uh, I want to go into right click program when you see Kodu shoot him. Now let's try playing the game. Now they're gonna try shooting us. They can't shoot through mountains, luckily. This would be too hard. No way for them. Did for space to go really, really quickly. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. So, see, this is how you kind of win the game. Kind of cool. You can, like, drive yourself through mountains and stuff. Cool thing is you can even go over mountains really quickly, so it's fun. Now you want to add some more objects. Let's say I don't know why this didn't run there anyway. Anyway, you might want to add more objects. So this is for like small valleys. It's just ra ma uh, random mountains around. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Now you might want to make more things. For example, on here, I'm gonna click. Maybe you want to make a tree. Okay, maybe that's a little bit too big. Let's just actually move this here. And you want to make another tree. So you click, click here. Oopsies. Oh, why is, it, why is this working so nice? There we go. You want to go here? Click tree. Let's just get one of these normal trees. Well, oh, these trees are big. There we go. We want to add more objects. Let's see. What should we add? Let's add a rover. Just a second. Sorry about that. Might want to make a rover. So you want you want my want, want to do I'm gonna program when you see like see all these. You, each one has more different ones. So when you let's say hmm when you touch actually never mind. So you wanna get rid of these, just press this, whole thing, delete. When you hmm, let's see. Keyboard. Actually, no, I wanted it to move by itself, let's say. So, going here, when? Let's say C. Let's see. Oopsies. C. A. Cannon. U. Move. Towards it. Slowly. When, and here you can put on what you want to do after he moves slowly. When you bump into a cannon, I don't know. Mm, inspect it. Like that. 
So let's check on this now. Oh, he's not doing much right now. I don't know why. Let's go! Oh no! Oh, okay! So, see, Ram just took a lot of hit points, but it's okay because I'm alive. Now, I think I need to program Rover a little bit differently. Go to, go to program, maybe not inspect. You just click on actions, express. <laughs> okay, like that. And this program, sorry. There you go, like that. How long time now? Oh, because the mountain's in the way. Go, Rover, go! Uh, sharp turns. Sharp turns! See, as you can, but it's a really simple game, but when you start developing it, it's quite fun, so you might want to try it yourself. Now let's try editing it more. See right now, wait, wait, let me just play one more time. When you come here, you bounce off. But what happens is you want your um, player to fall if you touch the, if you go to the edge of the world. What to do is go to change world settings. What to do glass walls off. Now there's going to be no glass walls there. Starting crime world, there's all these things you have. You can change all these if you want to. But now I'm going to change them a little more. Now, I haven't, I haven't done this, I've never actually done this before, but I, I'm just testing and playing with it. I don't know, something like that. What, and what happens? Oh no, my path was destroyed. And he just destroyed his team. Go, Rover! Oh, never mind. But something like this, quite cool. Now let's try. But right now, this is quite messed up. I don't even know I made this. I want to delete it. Just get rid of all this. I'm just gonna get rid of every single ball thingy. Delete. delete. Okay, I delete it. Delete. And. Delete. What? It didn't work? something else. So see you have all of these. Got ammo, castle, coin, factory. You can program your code to do lot to do lots of things. So let's say uh program. We instead of eating it, I want you to combat boom it. When you, when I click my left, I want you to shoot. Blip, once missile, whatever. I want you to shoot a blip. When I click my right, I want you to shoot a missile. When I move my Mouse around on you to you. Okay, I want you to uh, 
Hmm, what should I do? Well, because I wanted to move my view around. So first person view. Let's, let's try like this. Run away! Run away! Get control. Come on. I'm not gonna lose all my health. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, I'm alive! No, I'm not alive! I'm not alive! Oh, <laughs> look at him. We'll see. As you can see, it's quite fun. Although it's really hard to control right now. I don't know what I did with the controls. Sec. Like, um, program. Keyboard. Uh, okay. Hmm. Maybe I should do something else. Just sec. I can just delete that. If I do, oopsies, letters, a sec, a W, I want you to move, I don't really know, four, Make another one as well. When I do keyboard letter W A, I want to move left. But how do I move left? Uh, okay. Move. Okay. I think I'm just gonna end this video here. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.